Dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting further, I would like to tell you something. Please watch video completely and sit with copy pen. And if you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. If you find anywhere some problems or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share, and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Question is here A wooden block floating in a bucket of water has 4 by 5 of its volume submerged. When certain amount of an oil is poured into the bucket, it is found that the block is just under the oil surface with half of its volume under the water and half in oil. The density of oil relative to that of water is, uh, here are four options, first 0 0.6, option B 0 0.8, option C 0 0.7, option D 0 0.5. This question we have using Archimedes principle. What is Archimedes principle? Any object which is fully or partially immersed in the liquid, its weight get reduced by the weight of the liquid displaced by it. So therefore, you can see that this is the block and its volume, it is considered total volume is V and V by uh, 4 by 5 V is displaced. So therefore, weight of the block of the volume V is equal to weight of the water of volume displaced by this solid. So here, volume of this total block and density sigma B G equal to 4 by 5 V because this portion is immersed and density of water into G. So here G cancel V, V cancel then sigma B upon sigma W equal to 4 by 5. This is first part. Clear? Now for the second part, here it is given the question, some oil poured on this container and this block dipped such as half part in water and half part in oil. Okay. So therefore, again we have applying Archimedes principle. Then weight of this total block is equal to weight of this block which is immersed in the oil and second weight of the block which is immersed in water. Okay. Now, weight of the block is V sigma B into G. Sigma B means density of this block and G equal to V by 2 and uh, sigma O. O means oil and G plus V by 2 sigma W means density of water and G. You can see that V, V, V get cancelled out. G, G, G cancel out. Then sigma B equal to sigma O by 2 sigma W by 2. Now multiply by 2 sigma B equal to sigma O sigma W. Here sigma B upon sigma W equal to 4 by 5. So therefore sigma W divided both the side then we will get 2 into sigma B upon sigma W is equal to 4 by 5 then it can be written as sigma O upon sigma W equal to plus sigma W sigma W cancel out means 1. Then 4 to the 8 by 5 minus 1 equal to sigma naught or O upon sigma W. Then how much? Taking the LCM is 5, 8 minus 5 equal to sigma naught upon sigma W. Then 3 by 5 equal to sigma O upon sigma W. Then uh, sigma O upon sigma W equal to 0 0.6. So, it is correct answer. I hope so you understood this uh, question. Thank you for staying till the end of the video. And I remind you, those who have not subscribed yet, do it immediately by pressing bell icon. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.